first segment of the stream, now that we've gotten to it, is tier lists. No, you know what I actually have a very big opinion on? We're gonna do a fast food tier list. I see this shit so often, and it's an actual crime. Like, I saw someone put checkers in S tier, and I'm like, those are the soggiest fries I've ever had in my life. As someone who's not really tried a lot of fast food, I, you know, eat a lot of cooked food that I make or other things. There's gonna be some on here that I've never tried, and my opinions are gonna be very firm. I'm not a big fan of fast food, and so I feel like I, since I'm a bit unbiased, that I can show you guys what the best food actually is. Okay, we're gonna start with things that I've tried often, like Burger King. Burger King doesn't have nuggets, which I at least don't think so. They have okay food, like it's not, I definitely do prefer Wendy's. It's like a B tier, cause it's just, it's just, an, it's enough. Plus, you know, number 15, Burger King but Bettis. Wendy's is great from the one time I've had it. I'm not a fan of Wendy's like ice cream anymore though. When I was a kid, that shit went hard and now it doesn't. Chipotle I've had a couple times and honestly, pretty good experiences. I'll say one time it wasn't the best, so I'll give it, I don't think anything unless it's like I've always had a good experience will be an S tier. KFC actually, I'm gonna put in B, but this is where it might get a little biased. I actually don't really like fried chicken. This is just a personal preference, okay? This list might be a little bit biased. Their biscuits I've heard are gummy. My heart, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. McDonald's though? I would say the same level as Chipotle. Chipotle's a little bit higher, otherwise I'd move it up a bit, but it's, it's under there, it's under there. Panda Express goes above Chipotle though. I will say, I am a really big fan of Chinese food though. Panda Express is pretty, pretty solid. Every time I've gone, it's been a really good experience. One thing about McDonald's is the nostalgia. You know what, you're right. But when they have pretty good drinks, I had it when I was in the airport and stuck in the airport for eight hours and they have pretty decent sandwiches, chicken sandwiches. I will actually, I'm thinking about bringing up Burger King because the Burger King is the one that has the Big Mac, right? And I really like the Big Mac sauce. Chick-fil-A, over fucking rated. I actually won't even bring Chick-fil-A down to C. One, they hate the gays, so fuck that. Two, Chick-fil-A is over expensive. I had it for the first time in my third year of college. I'd never had it before. The greasiest thing I've ever had. The like bags that they put the chicken, like the sandwiches in, you put your hand in and your hand comes out wet. It has the secret grease that like, it doesn't look like it's greasy, but if you got a paper towel, just went, it is just completely soaked wet. I'm honestly putting it in C. They do have good like potato products and their hash brown things are pretty good. Besides that, no, it's in B. It's gotta be in B. I'm gonna talk about Subway. I actually don't like Subway and it's from a health safety perspective. Subway is okay. It is on the healthier side. But the food, if you think about it, respectfully, is laying out in the air for hours, for hours. I just have to put it even, almost in D. It was the most, I could make a better sandwich for everyone in half the time. Ingredients are low. It is a quick sandwich, so it's healthier if it's a sandwich, but like, uh-uh. Also, I'm pretty sure, I forgot how long it was ago, but the corporate head of it did some sus things and uh, you know, it's not always the best. D, it's in D now, I'm sorry. It's in D, it's just not safe. Wendy's is pretty good. It's okay, they're pretty They're pretty decent. Maybe a little bit under McDonald's though, because in my recent experiences with Wendy's, I was like, uh. God damn it, you guys can't hit me with the Wendy's nuts. Hit your face every time I say Wendy's, it's not fair. Arby's, we have the meats. I'm not impressed with Arby's, especially with knowing that they have a meat mountain that looks like death. Gonna have to put it in C. I think everyone can agree with me that Arby's is in C. The A in Arby's does not put it in A as much as they might think. Hopefully our our opinions align. <laughs> We're getting into the pizzas. I'm gonna do the pizzas last. I'm gonna think of like fast foody things. Taco Bell. Taco Bell's tough. Taco Bell's tough. I think Taco Bell goes in front of Burger King, but something is stopping me from putting it in A. Taco Bell is B for bowels. <laughs> Taco Bell make my ass go into turbo drive. Okay, this is probably why it's in B, but I'm thinking now it just goes in front of Chick-fil-A <laughs> from the, from the, what I'm hearing. I've had Taco Bell a couple times. It was okay. Like it wasn't bad. It was cause I got pretty safe options. And I think a lot of the foods will make you fucking sick, you know? Jack in the box. I think Jack in the box is nothing. 
extraordinary. I've heard just not nice things. I've only had it once. Better than KFC, I think I can agree with that. I think high C, I think we can all agree with. Let's talk about these pizzas though. I think Pizza Hut, I had a really good experience as a kid with their deep dish, but I have to say that their buildings are built like caves and they're very scary. So I'm gonna have to put it underneath Jackbox. I think, can we all agree? You might have made it too low. No, 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 no. I could not have it any higher. White Castle, I heard someone put D. I've never had it, so I agree. Sonic? I've had decent experiences with Sonic, actually. I've only tried their milkshakes, though, so I'm not really familiar with their food. So I think it's on the B scale. I think their food's not what they're known for. They are known for, like, their shakes and stuff. Popeyes? Popeyes is not that good, in my opinion. Once again, I am not a big fan of KFC, so I might, I might put it next to KFC, but that's once again knowing that I don't like fried chicken. DQ, oh my god. DQ made me so sick one time. Dairy Queen made me shit out everything. It was like the worst experience of my life. It was super embarrassing. I wasn't at home. I don't like shitting in other people's houses because it makes me nervous. They had no toilet paper. This was a guy's dorm. I had to go down to the lobby. Dairy Queen put me through some shit and I will not forget that. Moving on. Papa John's is pretty Decent, actually. Pretty good. Domino's, I don't really know much about them. I don't want to put them maybe above Pizza Hut. I heard you guys don't really like them, so I'm going to agree. Little Caesars. These, I don't know what that is. Oh, Five Guys. Five Guys was okay. I'm going to put it right there, actually. Five Guys is pretty... Actually, I might even put it there. I like their huge bag of fries. Amazing. I love fries. I can't get enough of fries. So that option is very near and dear. Little Caesar. It's probably decent. I'm not sure. I'm just going to pop these both right there. And that's my list. Well, actually, because I don't really know them, I might put them down here. You know, they weren't significant enough. It's decent list. I think, you know, my opinions are pretty based. I gotta say, I have pre-based opinions. 